A new era of at-home testing kits will test your blood, your mucus, your saliva, and your poop for a small fee. And then if there's anything wrong, don't worry, they have a new kit that'll fix all of your problems. Bloomberg reports on this exploding at-home testing industry. Two billion dollars now in sales because we are all hypochondriacs. According to the author, we are all abnormally anxious about our health now. If there's something that I can control so that I'm going to live longer, great. If there's some genetic thing I can fix or some this or some that, and there's something to test my stool that's going to make it happen, people are paying a lot of money for it. And yet the author reveals that the truth is we're all afraid of death, huh? We're all afraid of the end and we think that if I can control death and I can find happiness and I can eat this or drink that, then I'll have the happiness I want. But no money back guarantee on those kits, is there? As much as they offer, they don't deliver. Psalm 21. Be exalted, O Lord, in your strength. We will sing and praise your might. Not my might, not my plans, not my will, because those, those things change. I, I, I get on this and I lose that. I do it for six months and I fail. I'm, I'm weak. No matter how much you try to optimize me, that self-optimization fantasy never really lasts. Lord, your might, your strength, your will. Yes, help me to be a steward of the temple that you've placed me in. Help me to care for my body as best you want, but, but not because I'm in control of things, because you are. Not because my will be done, but your will be done. Give me health, not to be selfish, but to serve and praise you always.